guys, it's Justin here from Jack Production Studios, and today I will be doing a showcase of two of my newest customs. These two customs are Lego Star Wars Clone Arc Trooper Echo and Clone Arc Trooper Fives. So let's get right on to the review. So I'm going to start off with Echo. As you can see here, this is all uh, made using the new. Clone Wars Lego Arc Trooper helmet. So yeah, I'm just gonna give an overview of him before I go on into detail of different parts of him. I just want to say this right now: this figure all is 100% made by me. I did all the de detailing on here. I designed the decals. I applied the decals. I did all of that. So well, let's get um, right on. Uh, with the figure, so I'm gonna start off with the legs and work on to the top. Just gonna quickly show you his weapons. He has two of these pistols, not special whatsoever. But yeah, alright, so now I'm just going to uh, rotate him around quickly, get a 360 degree view of the figure. So yeah. Um, sorry if the light's a little bit out, blurry, let me just move that. But, uh, right here he just has plain legs with these stripes going all the way around. I don't know if you can see that. Just didn't do any in the back because that would, would have been nearly impossible to fit. And it continues onto the inside, so that does blue stripes right there. Yep. And, uh, I just want to say this right now, his legs are posable. Posable. See, nothing happens to the legs when I pose them. Yep. I can do it the other one too. I really want to, but eh, who cares? I just shut it off, but yeah, so, um. Yeah, that's pretty much it for the legs. He has the balloon knee pads, and. Yeah, that. Now, onto the, uh. uh torso. So, I'm just gonna use this now. Right here he has his handprint that he got. Although this is just kind of weird, I'm just gonna point this out. In the Clone Wars, if he gets the handprint while he's wearing regular clone trooper armor, I don't understand like why would it how would it have transferred onto his arc trooper armor unless he just replicated the handprint on there or painted it or whatever, but who cares? So he's he has the uh oh this is my standard arc trooper template. He has the handprint right there, and nothing special about that. And the back is just a uh, plain back, if you really want to see it. So yeah, um, I just want to show you this quickly. This is a comma made by me. It's just his comma. You know, the uh, blue markings he has right there. And it's gray, and it has the black outlining. So yeah. Um, well, that's pretty much it. So on the arms, he has these, uh, just plain, uh, arms, and then he has the blue stripe going down. No hand details there, no hand details here. And he just has the stripe going down there, too. Yep, so, uh, both areas of stripes. And, yeah, he has this, uh, pauldron I made. The blue on the side, and the, uh, Right on the side, ammo pouch right there, and his helmet. So show this off. He has the blue fin. His fin's blue. He has these uh, blue stripes, I guess they are, which Echo has. He has the blue cheeks and the breathers. I just put blue right in this area because it looks cooler, honestly. So yeah, that's pretty much it for the helmet too. Just he uh, he just has a regular clone face, and yeah, the backpack is just the logo one. So yeah, that's pretty much it for. Okay, let me just put his weapons back in his hands. And I'm pretty sure I'm not positive, but I'm pretty sure he has nothing on his. Feet, but if he does, just let me know in the comments below, and I'll 
Uh, oops, hot fail. Okay, there. And I'll, um, edit the figure and make it look better and more accurate. I do not have the antenna right now, which would be like right here. I'm gonna make that sometime in the future, but it would be in that area. So, yeah, now I'm gonna get on to Arc Trooper 5s. Alright, so here's Arc Trooper 5s. So, uh, yeah, I'm just gonna go right on to, to uh, start pretty much. He has the same legs as Echo, nothing special or unique about these legs, and he has a new gray, sorry about that, uh, gray comma with the blue stripes that go all the way around. So, yeah, <laughs> that's pretty much it for the legs. I'm, I'm not gonna go into too much detail, obviously, there's a blue stripes going around. <clears throat> Man, sorry about my voice. Right there. Yeah, so the blue stripes going around. He has the blue knee pads. So yeah, he has the uh, standard. <clears throat> sorry about that. He has the standard Arc Trooper template of mine. But this time, he has the uh, blue triangle he has. He actually has the uh, two lines right there. The two triangles, that one and that one. And I apologize for any background noise right now because I, d I hear my brothers. Not sure if this is being picked up on my camera. If it is, I apologize for it already. So yeah, he has the same pistols as what's his face, uh, Echo. So yeah, he has the same backpack, same back, nothing to really show. So yeah, um, the arms, he has the blue stripe, the gray right there, the gray right there, and the gray right there. So the decal wraps around from here all the way down to there. Same over here, wraps around to there. So yeah, uh, he has the ammo pouch on this side like he does in the Clone Wars. He has this side gray, this side dark gray, standard clone face, and he has the Lego Arc Trooper helmet. The blue stripe going down there. I just saw these in blue because honestly it looks better that way. And he has the blue cheeks in that design up there. The three of oh, the two dots and the triangle. And the blue and fin that goes all the way back. So yeah, I just want to say this right now, his legs are posable, as you can pretty much tell right now because I just bent him down, but they're posable. Yeah, so that is pretty much it for this review. I'm just going to go on to the end now. So that is it for these two figure figures, guys. <clears throat> I hope you guys enjoyed. Please make sure to rate, comment, and subscribe. I would appreciate it very much if I gained a new subscriber to my uh, group, oh, my channel, whatever. So yeah, uh, let me know what you guys think of these custom customs. They took me three days of designing decals, applying, and blah blah blah. And I actually had to go through and like, I spent a while like having to redo the. I had to redo this. Wow, fail. I had to redo uh, this part on this helmet there, on Fives' helmet, twice, and then the third time was finally perfect, but whatever, so, these figures took a lot of time to make, I apologize for any background noise while all this video has been going on, alright, so, yeah, that is it for this review, I know this is a bit longer than some of my other reviews, but the this review is obviously of two clones. I hope these are as good of quality or better than a lot of the uh, arc, well, a lot of the fives and echoes out there, or whatever. I just hope you guys like these figures a lot. So that they're like, wait, I should have made them like a while ago. I never really like felt like making them. And then Lego made it their new helmet. So yeah. <laughs> All right. So please make sure to rate, comment, subscribe. I'll see you guys next time. And sorry about the long outro. Bye.